at the Hubson X4, the H107L. I must say the first thing I notice is this is packaged very nicely. Let's start with the controller, non-altitude hold. It takes four AAA batteries. You get spare propellers, a prop remover tool, and also a USB charger. And then we have the drone here. You get a 3.7 volt, 300 milliamp hour LiPo. To turn it on, simply just plug it in like this. And there we go. So let's charge this up, and then I'll go over some of the functions of the controller and the drone. We have the H107L and we're all charged up. As I mentioned before, just plug it in to turn it on. And you got the flashing LEDs. So now we have to bind. So all you do is make sure the throttle's all the way down, turn it on, and we get an auto bind. And that's it, no up, down, or anything like that. Now this, every time you restart it, it starts in normal mode. It does have two modes. It has normal and expert. So this does not have like one key return or headless mode. It just has the 360 flips and normal and expert mode. Now these buttons here are your trims. You have your left, right trim, your forward, backward trim. You have your throttle trim, and then you also have your yaw trim. So to take off, all you do is just give it some throttle. So we are in normal mode. And normal mode is, is not bad. It's, it's kind of slow, but yes, I already flew this in expert mode. And when you flip it to expert mode, you need to be ready for what's about to come because you see this here, it, it's real mild, like just kind of slow. You got the yaw like that. So the yaw speed is, it's not too slow. It will not do flips in normal mode. You have to go to expert mode to do flips. And that's one thing that I want to talk about with this because the flips are a little bit different than other drones where you just like hit a button and then do a flip. So to go into expert mode, let's bring it over here because I want to show you what happens when you put it in expert mode. The pitch on this is ridiculous. So there's full pitch on normal. So to put it in expert mode, you push down on the right stick. And look at that pitch. <laughs> it just turns into a whole nother drone. But yeah, see the yaw? The yaw is really fast. Good thing we have the bright LEDs on the drone there to see which way is forward and reverse. You got the blue in the front and the red in the rear. But let's... <laughs> uh-oh, uh-oh. Sometimes the yaw is so fast, it's hard to keep track of which way you're facing. So, okay, before the battery dies, cause it is kind of cold out. Before the battery dies, I want to show you the flips. So the flips, like I said, you have to be in expert mode. You have to like flip it. You see that? You see how I, come back here, come on. See them nice bright blue LEDs. So let's do a front flip. You have to go down up and then you do a front flip. So let's do a back flip. So you go up back. Whoa, that came down pretty far. Uh, and then to do like, you see that? You have to do. So let's do another, let's do a roll. <laughs> Yeah, this thing, this thing is really fast in expert mode. Like I said, it, it's it's kind of slow and boring in normal mode, 
but when you put it in expert, this thing is, is so fast. <laughs> I mean, look how fast it's going across the field. Oh, you see the flashing lights. I actually tried to raise my altitude, but it just came right down and just cartwheeled across the field here. Luckily, this is a pretty common battery. Luckily, I have other batteries from other drones, even though this one only came with one battery. I do have other batteries that I can plug in here and I can keep going with this. And I'm gonna do that because this thing's a lot of fun. That last flip did it. That flashing, you see the LEDs flashing, that is the low voltage detection. So it won't be long, this thing will be coming down because ran out of battery. But you do get about six to eight minutes. You're pushing more of the six minutes when you're flying in expert mode all the time. You might get eight minutes if you just keep it in normal mode. All right, let's let's land this thing here. Let's just come down in the grass. So, so that is it. That is the X4 H107L, and man, this thing is pretty awesome flyer. Normal mode is great for beginners. Uh, it, it's kind of slow, gives you a chance to get used to the controls. Expert mode is exactly that. It is. For the experts it is pretty fast so i'd recommend flying this outdoors in a big open area like this because i mean you cover a lot of ground really fast with this now the flips once you once you get used to how the the stick goes to do the flips it gets a little easier but it's still a little harder than just pushing a button and, and picking a direction so other than that that's like the only negative i really have about it is the flips but i hope to see you with the next ready to run rc